An Australian diving club is encouraging women to experience the underwater world and be part of a support network. The Tasmanian mermaids meet up to scuba, but also to chat about their problems. The mermaids are mainly women, but also accept some men, and they meet up on a regular basis to dive and snorkel. Tasmanian Mermaids founder Jane Ruckert says that the club is really just a community where they can chat about problems, meet up for a dive, celebrate women in diving, science, marine world, and their love and fascination for it. The group does travel around Tasmania and interstate, but they are mostly found in and around Hobart. First, they put on their equipment and check that it's all in working order. Then Jane Ruckert conducts a safety briefing. These adventures under the sea are fertile in stories to be shared back on the beach. More than 25 nations are presenting sustainable ideas during this year's 48 show. Under the theme Growing Green Cities, countries are blending old and new in their national pavilions. The event showcases horticultural innovations that can make urban areas more sustainable and healthier as people around the world increasingly shift to cities. The event is a melting pot of ideas, traditions and techniques. The Qatari team's buildings resemble traditional pigeon loft structures the Japanese team has created a thatched roof. China is showcasing new uses for bamboo, a traditional building material. Floriad expects to welcome 2 million visitors as the displays shift through the seasons from springtime to summer and autumn. And amid a Dutch affordable housing crisis, the Floriade terrain is, in, is envisaged to become a new urban area of 3,000 homes after the expo ends on October the 9th. Let's be sold. I'm going to finish.